Hey y'all, it's Devin with Benchmore Bats. Got another bat review for y'all today. I have the Anarchy Ant. This is 26 ounces. It is a 12 inch barrel with a full ounce end load. Uh, already has probably about 200 cuts on it. Once again, USA, ASA only. Uh, back out here in Japan, another 82 degree day. Uh, just gonna do some work off what the I think about it. Uh, I already know what I kind of think about it, but let me hit it a few times so y'all can maybe see and hear and we'll talk about it some more while I'm swinging it, okay? So once again, this is the Anarchy Ant. It uses their X-Core technology, or sorry, cross-core technology. I say X-Core because it's literally an X with a core written in the logo. Uh, basically what that technology is, is this is a, a harder barrel. It allows you to hit 44, 375, as well as 52, 300 core balls. So unlike Monsters, these can hit harder balls. You can use them in lower temperatures. It's a much stiffer barrel, much harder barrel. But that also comes with some trade-offs. The trade-off with that is, uh, with the harder barrel, it takes longer to break it in. Uh, everyone knows anarchies are known for being, you know, putting a thousand cuts on them before they finally start becoming hot and really competing with the monsters. Oh, topping that. Um, however, there is one trade off here. This amp in particular, for some reason, the first batch amps came extremely hot out the wrapper. This thing, balls are just popping off of it when I was using it in live BP in practice, uh, just flying. You know, this is, if I go into a home run derby right now, this is the bat I'm gonna use versus the creature, versus the torch, versus the sideboard, it's this baby. However, because it's a 12 inch barrel, you have a lot less space to work with. So you have to be really on your game as a hitter. Uh, this was my gamer for a while, however, um, my consistency is not there. Uh, like I said, this thing, I'm either sending it over the fence, um, or as was happening to me in games, I'm sending it a mile high into the air right to the pitcher. Um, which isn't good. The ball flies off this bat, I will say, um, but like I said, it's a short barrel. It's also a one ounce end load and it is very noticeable end load. Um, so if you don't like end load, this is not the bat for you. Lots of line drives today, apparently. There's one. Ah, probably about 280. Uh, two more here. And I'll tell you guys. What I think. One more. Oh. Ah, that might have been it. I'm at 300. We'll stop there. I love this bat a ton at first. Uh, for some reason, right now. I just, I'm not consistent with it. My creature is my gamer right this now. This thing, if you miss hit it, it is not forgiving. But if you hit that thing in the sweet spot, in the money, the ball is, it's, it's a no doubter. That thing is gone, ain't nothing. You can just walk straight back to the dugout, get your high fives, take a seat on the bench. You did your job. I'm not that most consistent of a hitter. Uh, I've only been playing for about a year now, so I'm getting there. But uh, this is one, you know, you know, it's torn. I, I really liked it at first. You know, like I said, the best thing about Anarchies, you can use both cores of balls. They can hit harder balls. They last forever, man. These things are tanks. Uh, however, I will say this, uh, this is a 2020 model. Um, there was an issue with the 2020 models where they have an issue with their restrictor. So if you're familiar with Monsters, they have a thing called a fib floating in their barrel. With Anarchies, they have a restrictor in them. Uh, what the difference is, I have no clue, but uh, the restrictor would come loose after about 500 swings or so. And then you'd have to send it in and, you know, just like I give props to Monster, I'll give props to Anarchy. 
you send them the bat, they fix it, they send it back. I do recommend it if you are a really good, solid hitter, super consistent, and you, you, you're getting center of the barrel, you're in that sweet spot every time. There's gonna be no better bat for you if you just wanna hit bigger all day long. If you wanna max out your home runs for your team, uh, this, this is the bat you want in your hands. So thank you guys, I uh, appreciate it. Um, just let me know if there's anything I do different. Uh, I tried the T-workout today because I forgot the pop toss. Uh, let me know if y'all like the T-work, I'm gonna keep going. I think in the future I might do half and half, do half on the T, half on the pop toss. But once again, uh, thanks for checking out the channel guys and I'll see you later.